What's up tubes? I wanted to make a short how-to video on how to make um, solid unbreakable foot pegs for the mini Baja um, mini bike um, for under five dollars um, instantly the same day um, within an hour. Okay now as everybody knows the stock foot pegs that they make for these Baja Motorsport bikes, the MB165 and MB200, are absolute garbage. You know, they snap off, <laughs> well, for me, they snapped off the same day. As soon as you go out on a good, decent trail and hit a decent bump or jump, they snap right off. So they broke off, and um, what I ended up doing was I went on YouTube. 4x4 off-road had a good idea. Um, they sell these aluminum foot pegs for the Honda CBR1000 dirt bikes. They sell the set, you know, a pair for $5.56. Uh, that was okay. But the problem with that is it's cast aluminum. And they also snap. As soon as you hit a decent well, for me, I went down a 20-foot incline and hit one decent jump, and one of them snapped right off. So, so quick, it was unbelievable. Now, they sell, they sell billet aluminum foot pegs, um, 50 calibers, for $50 for a pair. Now, if you want to spend $50, you could do that. And they look good. And with some minor shaving of the ends, they'll they'll fit on. Okay, but the problem is you're spending fifty dollars. You have to wait for them, and there's no guarantee. They're still aluminum, and they still could snap. All right. The way to fix this problem, basically, and make them unbreakable, or or nearly unbreakable, is what you do is I'm going to show right now go to Home Depot and you buy an eight foot, eight feet, eight inch long, half inch wide piece of plumbing pipe. Okay, just like this. You cut it directly in half. Then with the pins that came with the original foot pegs, right, you line it up, you drill a hole right through the pipe, right, and then boom, you can pop this in and then put an end cap on. This is solid, okay? This is not gonna break. There's no way this is gonna break. This can't break, this can't break. It's solid steel, see? There's no way that's gonna break. The only thing that's possible that could still break is the pin itself. And for that, I have spare pins, right? So if that pin was ever to break, keep this nearby, either keep it in your pickup truck or, you know, wherever, in your pocket if necessary, if you think you're gonna break these. And you have um, backup ones immediately to put it right back on. Because that's the only thing that I could still see being a possibility to break. There's no way this piece of solid steel is gonna break. There's no way this piece of solid steel is gonna break. The only thing I could see possibly still breaking is the pin that holds that on, okay? Now, you don't need to be an expert. Okay, you don't need to be some kind of metal expert. You don't even need to have precision tools. All right, I cut this in half with a grinder on a vice grip. And I took a drill and a metal drill bits made to cut through metal, to go through metal. Drilled the hole directly through and on it went. And then I used a pipe wrench to put the end cap on. That was it. It's that, that simple. It's not, it's not perfect. I didn't use precision tools, but it holds. It's straight, right? See, same, same thing with this side. It holds, that ain't going nowhere. Nowhere. That's how you do it. That costed me $4.24, and they didn't even, they didn't even charge me for the end caps. The end caps are like $1.74 a piece. If you want them, you don't even need them. But as you see, when I put my feet on here, right, you hit anything with these, 
they aren't breaking off. They're not going to break off. There's no way. They're not going to bend. They're not going to break. And if that pin holding them on does break, you just bring spare pins. That's it. Because, and that's how you solve the problem. Okay? Like I said, you can go this route. These are a little bit more professional looking, right? They look like real foot pegs. They are real foot pegs, but this is cast aluminum. And they are prone to snapping because it's aluminum. As you can see. See that? Snap right there. Now they sell those, like I said, they sell those billet aluminum ones. Those billet aluminum ones are supposedly nearly unbreakable. And right? that's the stuff you use to make, to put on the flywheel and on, on the engine, on the connecting rod, so that the, the engine can't <laughs> blow on you. But even that isn't 100%, and you're paying $50. This, $4.24 done in an hour and that's how it's done folks um, rate comment subscribe let me know how this works out for you give me a thumbs up if you uh, like this video like I said Home Depot 8 inch long half inch piece of plumbing pipe in the plumbing section with two end caps you can either get the black metal or the galvanized cut it directly in half drill a hole through directly through pop it on put the pin in put the end cap on done deal you'll never have to worry about your foot pegs breaking ever again okay later tubes